Hey, I'm Tony Anderson, and welcome to Red, White, and Black, where the issue of race meets the presidential race. If President Barack Obama had been more aggressive in the debate versus Mitt Romney, would he be labeled angry black man? Maybe, but it doesn't even matter. The President Barack Obama is beyond race. He needs to focus on the facts. And the fact of the matter is, he spent more time after the debate apologizing and making excuses for why he lost than actually concerned about the facts. President Barack Obama went on Diane Sawyer and said, I had a bad night. Let's get right to it. Yeah. That debate, what happened? Well, uh, Governor Romney had a good night. I had a bad night. Then he talked to Tom Joyner and said, I was too polite. These are things that are more concerning than being labeled angry black man. This is not a damned if you do, damned if you don't situation. First, life and liberty. We have a responsibility to protect the lives and liberties of our people. Part of being a leader is A, being able to describe exactly what it is that you intend to do. Uh, not just saying, I'll sit down, but you have to have a plan. John McCain, who ran against President Barack Obama in the last election, used to be in the Army. He understands rank. Mitt Romney's a businessman. He doesn't care about rank. All he understands is winning at all costs. Barack Obama, you have to know your opponent and you have to not necessarily stoop to his level, but if he's gonna sling mud at you, you have to at least give strong counterpoints. And a lot of people were saying that he didn't do that. So more importantly than being labeled angry black man was the fact that he even said or he even felt that he took an L. So he has two more debates in order to bring it back. He has to win them. This has been Red, White, and Black. See you at the polls.